Well, sometimes a morning wake-up call just isn't good enough. Sometimes you need to go inside the machine and listen to a bitch about the outlet knock sensor. All right, 963C, 3126. Operator complaint. Well, she apparently starts and runs but won't move. Funny how she starts and runs and won't move. It's only got one module it sees and it doesn't want to start. And this here battery is uh, definitely seeing better days. So, yeah. Fun, 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 fun. You know, I like the concept of remote flash. I really do. But my thing is, you're pretty much just stuck here waiting until this thing completes after it's been initiated and just flash started. Okay, well, I really would wish they would give us a progress bar or something like that so we knew what the fuck was going on during it. But, you know, I'm sure they'll update that at some point, right? Right, Cat? You listening? That's a crazy thing. When you put a belt on there and it actually charges with new batteries, she'll actually move. It's fucking crazy. Well, there's a drive belt tensioner, boys. Yeah, she's not loving life. Have a good day, boys. There's the bell. You know, if you would have given me this answer roughly about uh, four months ago, you'd been right. But you're not. Sorry. So platform's only rated for 300. Control valve weighs 460 plus pounds. Guess what? Um, yeah, I don't believe in those ratings. I don't believe they're real. But guess what? That fucking platform put in that work today, though. Man, I feel like a real goddamn operator today. Look at that. I got a fucking fault light on my damn dash, man. Uh, I can tell you what. We're going to do that service when I fucking feel like it. I ain't down this fucking thing. All right. So here we have a 966M that happened to hit another 966M. So if you see right over there, you've got the original DEF platform, and then you have the new one. But also, if you look right under the machine there, you can see that, yeah, um, it also struck the actual fuel tank, sheared the bolts off on that, and uh, in the process of dumping out, what, 80 gallons of uh, diesel fuel, just to go ahead and bring that down, fix all that. So it's been a pretty productive day, I guess you could say. So, hopefully you guys had a great day. Kill it tomorrow. See you. All right, remember guys, if the quality sensor installation status is not installed, keep it not installed. Because here we go. We got a 315 that we're putting a hole repair kit in, a hole sensor kit, because of communication fault with the quality sensor for a machine that didn't even have it installed on. Happy day.